It's a Wonderful World 1939 is a romantic screwball comedy mystery, starring Claudette Colbert and James Stewart and directed by W.S. Van Dyke. Topic. Plot Private detective Guy Johnson James Stewart, is well paid to watch over Willie Hayward Ernest Truex, a wealthy man who likes to drink a bit too much and gets into trouble as a result. However, when Hayward's recent ex-girlfriend Dolores Gonzalez Cecilia Callejo, makes a public nuisance of herself over their relationship, a drunk Hayward goes to see her. It is a setup. Dolores is being held at gunpoint by a man, and when Hayward enters her apartment, the mystery man kills Dolores and frames Hayward for the murder. The only clue is a half of a dime incorporated into a piece of jewelry that the victim managed to snatch from her assailant. Guy hurries to the scene soon after and hides his client so he can catch the real killer, but both of them are nabbed by the police, tried, convicted and sentenced, Guy to prison for a year, Hayward to be executed. It is revealed to the audience that Hayward's new wife Vivian Francis Drake and her lover, Al Malin Sidney Blackmer, are behind the whole thing. She stands to inherit Hayward's millions. In addition to her lover, the unfaithful woman discovers that her husband Ned Brown George Meeker, whom she thought was dead, is alive. Brown, an actor, unexpectedly arrives from Australia and starts blackmailing her. On the way to jail, Guy comes across a clue, a newspaper personal ad from Half a Dime, asking to be contacted at a certain location. Guy jumps from the moving train into a river, taking along the bumbling policeman handcuffed to him, Sergeant Fred Koritz, Nat Pendleton. His struggle with Koritz is witnessed by noted poet Edwina Corday, Claudette Colbert. After knocking Koritz out and freeing himself from the handcuffs, he has no choice but to kidnap her to prevent her from sounding the alarm. At first, she believes him to be a dangerous criminal, but she soon discovers he is telling the truth about his mission, and insists on sticking with him, much to his annoyance, as he has a low opinion of the intelligence of women. The trail leads to a small theater group run by Madame Chambers, Cecil Cunningham. Guy gets himself hired as an actor to better figure out who knows about the half dime. Guy brings in his associate, Cap Streeter Guy Kibbe, to help with the investigation, only to have Edwina mistake him for a policeman and knock him out. Meanwhile, Vivian and Malin decide it is better to silence her husband rather than submit to his demands. However, Malin kills the wrong actor, a last minute replacement, during a performance of What Price Glory? Guy is arrested by the police, but Edwina tricks them into going to where Brown lives to look for a diary that implicates Guy in the first murder. When they drive to the address she gives, they catch Vivian and Malin in the process of taking away a bound and gagged Brown. Topic. Cast Topic. Filming locations San Diego, California